Hello everyone, if you like me and you bought a fan 3 standard, you should know that the antenna has the floor, which is it's really flexible, not really flexible but quite bobbly. It's no problem on its own, see, but it's a problem when you add a windsurfer, because most of you do not have adequate range. <clears throat> we all buy windsurfers, and that's what happens when I shake it. It's fall side off. And I found a solution to this problem. And I want to share with you all. So, let's go change the lens. There. Let's wait, let's move the camera a bit. <coughs> so, there you go. You can see that that antenna has like a little slit on there. And slit on its side. Let's go focus on there. There you go. There's here still on the side. When it's straight up like this, it doesn't really wobble that much. Of course, the whole thing's pushing on this part, on this bottom collar thingy. When you do this, all that holds it in is that little slit on there. You can see a little slit on there. Let's go focus on there again. You see? That's what's holding it in. I recommend you watch it in full resolution so that you can actually see the whole process so that's what you got to tackle with see flimsy antenna and i've developed a new <coughs> solution with this instead of buying the ARG tech antenna thingy you can actually buy this i mean not really buy make i got like one of those sim card holders and just chop it up to this size so <coughs> Let's put this on the antenna first, so you can actually see the difference. Flimsy antenna. And let's put this thing on. Wait. Let's not cover this thing. Now let's zoom it in. So, see this thing. It actually has like two little grips on the side. Focus. Oh, camera, focus. There. Oh, it hasn't focused. There you go. See that it actually has two little grips on here that I just made those are to catch the size of the antennas right there and the bottom piece is actually to hold the antenna <coughs> down here so I'm gonna be flashing measurements on screen there you go and pause if you want now let's continue again with the video you got this, and you just, oh, it just fell down. Wait. It's quite hard to fasten it on camera, so just make sure these two little things are on a 90 degree angle. I put some blue tack by the way, so it actually will stick on the antenna, because on the bottom side. So when you're flying, this doesn't just fall off. So, <clears throat> see this little fox? Let's Wait, let's focus there again. The camera doesn't really want to focus there. Okay, so you see these two little prongs, just put these little prongs in there, <clears throat> and then put this little yellow tab thingy, which I have, just press it in with the blue tag, there you go, the antenna stiff. The only thing flexing now is the plastic of the antenna, not the base, the base solid of this little yellow thing, attached me. If you want to get a bit more stiffness, just Go and press the sides, your nails like this, just press them, and you got a really stiff antenna. So now, <coughs> let's try to put the windsurf front it, and see how it feels with the standard antenna. So, let's put the windsurf down here. You can actually fix this also with a rubber band from here going down to there, but it's going to be quite wasting rubber band. So, one. Two, three, four, five. That's the strong. Thanks to this yellow thing. So thanks for watching, everyone. Hopefully this fix your antennas and please like and subscribe.